In this video, I'm going to help you to find out why YouTube is not working on your Roku and hopefully get it to working. So I'm going to give you a few solutions and let's see if one of them will work for you. First one is make sure that YouTube is working on other devices in your home, like on a smartphone or on another TV. It's possible that YouTube just might be down everywhere in the world, so it might not be an issue with your, with your Roku. That's the first thing. So yeah, make sure you check it on other devices. Uh, next thing is to make sure you got good internet connection. So make sure that you know your your TV is close enough to the router, or if it's connected to Ethernet, because it could be that is the issue. Try other apps. You know, if something else doesn't work, then it, then it's not your YouTube. It could just be in general you're not getting a good connection. Okay, next thing you want to do is update YouTube. If that didn't solve your problem. So in order to do that, you're going to go to the YouTube app, and you're going to hold down the asterisk. You're going to hit the asterisk button. So that's going to give you some different options. And so what you're going to do is you're going to choose Check for Updates, and that should take a few minutes. Okay, after you did that, Next thing you want to do is just restart the Roku device in general. Just go ahead and restart it. So what you want to do is go to Settings. Go to Settings and then go to System. And then go down to Power. So you can just System Restart. So that's the next thing you would do, and then after that, if that doesn't fix the problem, what you want to do is you want to update Roku. So how do you do that? Go to Home, and then go to Settings, and then you want to go down to Back to System, and you go to Software Update. So then, so you're updating your Roku. Now, if that doesn't work, then you'll go to your YouTube app. You want to hit asterisk again. Hit the asterisk button right there. And then what you want to do is you want to remove the channel altogether. So after you remove it, then reinstall it and then see if that helped you fix your problem. All right, I do appreciate you watching and make sure you subscribe.